Cheryl and Allen, today we learned the boy's mother has retained her own attorney separate from the boy's father. Police have not said either one of them is a suspect. For the second time in as many nights, law enforcement searching the family's home. Earlier detectives approached the missing boy's father on the street, who made this appeal to his son. AJ, please come home. We love you very much. We, you're not in any trouble. We're just worried to desk it. Please, please come home. Police say five-year-old AJ was reported missing by his parents, who say they last saw him at bedtime Wednesday night. Authorities don't believe he was kidnapped. Canines picking up AJ's scent only in the home, suggesting he did not wander out. Joan came here today to stay, hoping that AJ would come back at any moment and walk through <laughs> the house. <laughs> AJ's mother, Joanne Cunningham, has retained her own attorney. Ms. Cunningham cooperated with the police extensively yesterday until at some point we got the impression that she may be considered a suspect. As the mystery deepens and anxiety in the neighborhood grows, we're learning AJ and his family have had multiple contacts with DCFS. AJ's younger brother has been placed in a different home. We're just extremely worried. If anybody knows anything about where Andrew Jr. is, please, please contact the Crystal Lake Police Department. Let's get him home. AJ's mother declined to make a statement. Her attorney says she's not staying here at the home, and tonight it appears neither is AJ's father. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.